Hey guys, so today's video is going to be a makeup collection video. Also, I'll be showing you my organization, how I organize my makeup and my hair stuff and all that. And all the stuff that has to do with like hair, makeup, skin, whatever. So, I do have quite a collection for a beginner. Um, I probably have more than the average person should have or would have. Uh, I have an obsession with makeup, obviously. That's what my channel is about, makeup and hair. Um, I'm not bragging. A bunch of people do these videos. I just want to give my tips and show you my collection and what I do to organize my stuff and I think a lot of you guys are going to benefit from this video because a lot of girls struggle with organizing their makeup. I know I do. I've been struggling with this for years because honestly this is a very expensive thing to do. It's very expensive to organize makeup. Products alone are expensive. You know drawers, Alex drawers. I do not have those but I have something similar to them. But anything that has to do with like a vanity, you know, anything that has to do with makeup storage, makeup lighting, uh, all that's expensive. So I have some good tips and I also have like a lot of stuff you guys are probably going to benefit from. So whatever I talk about, like not my makeup products, but like my organization stuff and my vanity and my mirror, I'm definitely going to link that down below so you guys can, you know, buy one yourself or something similar to it. So pretty much... This is not me bragging. A lot of people do this. I'm not the only one. But please do not compare my collection to uh, Carly, Carly Bible because I'm not, not, I have nothing compared to any of those other beauty gurus on here. So yeah, I'm just going to get started. I'm going to get started showing you my vanity. So I'm going to flip my camera around in my screen to show you. So I am now sitting and talking to you and looking in my mirror. So here is my vanity. And that's the mirror I use. And you can actually see me, so I will get up to show a better view. And this vanity is by Impressions Vanity, so it, this mirror is like 300 to $400. Uh, I got this on eBay. This is, I haven't seen this color um, this is like a pink purpley color. It's metallic chrome and my vanity, I got this at Marshall's uh, a long time ago and then it just has two drawers and then above it, I made that name, that's my name, Caitlin, obviously, and I got those stickers at the dollar store. So if you guys are interested, I will link all that and those letters I made myself. So I actually have a tutorial on how I did that. So those are just stuff from Michael's. And then that pink heart lights up. I think it works. Let me see if it turns on. Yeah, so that lights up at night. So it's really pretty. I think my mom got this at the Christmas tree shop. So I'll try and find that as well. So on my vanity, I just have my, my toothbrush and my toothpaste and another toothbrush right there. And again, about this light. Now this part that you see right there. I actually did that myself. That's just craft ribbon from Michaels. I'll link that too if you guys want to do that to your makeup mirror. It just makes it look pretty. So this mirror has an on and off switch, obviously. So you turn it off. That's what it looks like when it's off. Um, it has an outlet on the side to where you can, you know, plug your like straightener and your hair dryer. And then, yeah, so that's pretty much my vanity area and then in the drawers I just have some brushes and toothpaste and another uh, toothbrush head for my Sonicare toothbrush. This drawer I have my clips, my scrunchies and a bunch of random stuff. And then over here, right here, this little table, this little storage area I have my extra, like all my makeup is stored in here. So those two straighteners you see are cooling off because I just used them. So I have my makeup brushes right here. And then I have this little thing with everyday stuff that I use every single day. So I just have like some setting spray, some uh, chapsticks, concealer, highlighter, lipstick. Mascara, face primer, eyelash curler, and more brushes. And then in here I just have some stuff I use every single day. 
some primer, a highlighter, um, foundation, powder, a bunch more random stuff. So I have, uh, what are these? Eyeshadow primer, concealer, blush, lip scrub, <coughs> a bunch of random stuff in here. The next drawer is some little eyeshadows, some flossing stuff, some nail clippers, eyebrow clippers, uh, eyelash, um, curler, pads. And that's everything for that little cube. I got this cube on Amazon and it was about $20. So this just holds like everyday stuff that you use like every single day. So it's better than going in a drawer and having to grab it out. I'll link this down below, and if I can find these, I'll link them as well. So now moving on to the inside of my drawers. So this top drawer, I have my blushes and my foundations. So like I said, if you guys want like an in-depth um, makeup collection, I can do that where I show you every single little thing I have. If you want that, give this video a thumbs up and a comment. So here's all of my... Um, foundations. I have a bunch of drugstore foundations. Most of my products are drugstore. Keep that in mind. Um, blushes pretty much. And then back here I'm actually going to take this drawer out because it's so heavy. So back here I just have some more highlighters and bronzers So and more face powder. So most of these are highlighters. So you guys can see so this is how I store my makeup and these white things right here I got at the dollar store for a dollar they hold a lot of products and they're great for inside drawers like I have my stuff so I'm going to put this back if I can with one hand and I forgot to mention where I got this whole thing so this whole thing I got this at a grocery, a grocery store called Alden's or Aldi, whatever you want to call it. This was $40. So it's really affordable and it's really nice. I put this together by myself. Let me get this straightener out of the way. And I will link this down below if I can. So the second drawer, I just have some concealers, mascara, a face powder back there. More foundation, another foundation, a setting spray, my beauty blenders. And again, I got these little um, organizers at the Dollar Tree, so they were only a dollar. The next drawer is one of my favorite drawers. This is my eyeshadow. These are my single eyeshadows. So I have Milani, L'Oreal, more Milani. Uh, I think these are Maybelline. <clears throat> Some NYX. And then I have like bare minerals, loose powders. I have my shimmer loose powders over here for your eyes. And then back here is a bunch of random like eyeliners, stuff that is not going to fit in there. So I just throw those back there. And then these little things I got at the Dollar Tree once again. They were only a dollar, so recommend those. Down here is where my palettes are. So these are like face palettes. <clears throat> All of these are face palettes. So I have like contour, eyebrow palettes, highlighting palettes, blush palettes. Um, just a bunch of palettes that wouldn't fit in any other drawers. And these do not have any organizers. I just threw them in this drawer because they looked good in there. So that's all of my bronzer and highlighting palettes. The next drawer is all of my eyeshadow palettes and I am an eyeshadow queen. I love eyeshadow. Look at all those palettes, guys. So I have tons of eyeshadow palettes. I have Urban Decay, Lorac, uh, more Urban Decay, a bunch of different eyeshadow palettes. If you guys want a eyeshadow palette collection video, let me know in the comments because I can do that. So that is how I store all my eyeshadow now. They're not in any order. They're just in there. And then the last bottom is a bunch of nail art stuff. So this is where I keep a lot of my nail art stuff.
I have tons of nail stuff, fake nails, all kinds of stuff, nail glitters. <clears throat> the last drawer, well, one of the last ones is all my lipstick. So you see these lipsticks and this little divider. I got this on Amazon or eBay. These are draw dividers. And they're only like 99 cents, I believe. So here's all my lipsticks. And they're... I'm not going to go through all of my lipsticks because this will take forever. But I have tons. I can do a lipstick collection video as well. And then... In this drawer, I just have my makeup uh, brush cleaner mat. That's by Sigma. It's awesome. And then the rest of these drawers, like this one's empty, this one's empty, this one's empty. Because I just got this, so I'm not trying to fill the whole thing. And then the last drawer down here, I have more nail stuff. So that's it for this whole cart. So once again, that's all of my makeup. And that little guy. And then over here is just like a dresser with clothes in it and stuff. Nothing <clears throat> too good to look at. So. Oh man, my throat is so dry. And then moving on. So this is my makeup chair. I also got this on Amazon as well. This was a hundred and something dollars. It has rhinestones on the back. And then it's just a regular black chair. And so, I'll just push that over, and then we'll go move on to over here. So this whole section, you see, this has all my hair stuff in it, and like, oh yeah, so I'm just going to get started. So the top of this little station, I have my makeup mirror I use every day for like, close-up application so in the bottom of it it's all like blinged out I got this at TJ Maxx I have a spray bottle and then over here in these little bins I got these three little bins at five below they're like five bucks so over here I just have all of my perfumes I have Bath and Body Works a thousand wishes twisted peppermint Victoria's Secret warm and cozy mist all of my um, perfume right here over here I just have some random stuff some razors some nail polish remover act mouthwash and then more perfume over here over here I have my little brush cleaner this is a thing you dip your brushes in and it instantly takes off any powders and it's like dry so you don't have to like worry about washing them so much I got that on Amazon for like five bucks some hairspray, some mousse, some hair curling spray, and then some cotton pads. Now over here to this drawer, I have on top, I have some Keratin Complex Conditioner. Macadamia Natural Oil Deep Repair Mask. It wouldn't fit in my drawer. Back here I have some pink body lotions. And then over here is just some random um, stuff, but this drawer is not in use, it's just there. Okay, so over here, starting with this chopped drawer, I have some blow dryers. Um, so these are all my hair dryers. So these are my hair dryers. I only have two, and then I have a bunch of attachments that go with them. The second drawer, I just have all my hair straighteners, which two of them are over there. Next drawer, I just have all my curling irons. So, I have a curling gloves, curling irons, curling wands. I have one, two, three, four curling irons. And this drawer right here is all my hair bleach. So, these are all the stuff I used to bleach my hair. I know, so much. <clears throat> These are shampoos and conditioners and a hairbrush. Over here is some more hair styling tools. Well, not tools, but hair styling products. I have leave-in conditioners, uh, hair serums, and oils in this drawer. 
Um, I can do an updated uh, hair product collection if you guys want. In this drawer, I just have some more um, hair styling products, some heat protectant stuff, some more leave-in conditioners. Dry shampoos in this drawer. Some more hair products, like styling products. Some more over here. Um, this is where I keep all my hair masks. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six. And then I have seven. That one's in the shower. Hairspray. Some random more hair styling products over here. This is my shampoo and conditioners. Again, so I have tons and tons of shampoo and conditioner. <clears throat> Again, more shampoo and conditioner in this drawer. The rest of these drawers down here are empty. So all these are all empty. In this cart, oh, and I forgot to tell you, almost forgot. This big thing with all these drawers I got from my dad for Christmas. Now this was, I think, $150. I'll link them down below. You can probably find them on sale on Amazon or eBay. Over here, this is a single cart. This was only 80 at Michael's. So, on the top, I just have some face products. So, these are all of my um, makeup removers and, yeah, all makeup removers in that drawer. This drawer is face masks, face scrubs, and face wash. That's what I keep in there. This drawer is more like face toners, face lotion, that kind of stuff. This drawer is body wash. This drawer is like lotion. This drawer is my foot drawer where I keep like stuff to help my feet get rid of dry skin. This drawer is my tanning lotion. <clears throat> this drawer is my eyebrow waxing drawer. So I have like my eyebrow waxing stuff in here. This drawer is empty. And this drawer is my hair brushes. My extra ones. So guys, that's everything. And then this little guy over here is just random stuff. Like my rabbit's food. Uh, more random stuff. And then this is like a bunch of random stuff as well. That's like makeup I don't want. So, so guys, that's everything for my whole collection. So, take a step back. Here's what it looks like. And then, yeah. So the last thing I'll show you is my nail polish rack. So here's all of my nail polish. And this rack I got on, I think Amazon or eBay for like $70, I believe. And this holds like 180 bottles of nail polish, I'm pretty sure. So yeah. So guys, that was everything for my collection, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you in my next video. If you're wondering what those are in the back, that's my filming lights. Those are what I use to film, and yeah. So that's everything. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will definitely see you in another video. Hopefully you enjoyed this. If not, you can give it a dislike. I really don't care. So anyway, that's everything, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.